Well, it's Tuesday, April 5th. I'm at the fairgrounds, and yes, I know I'm holding my phone this way, but this way I at least know it's going to be not going to be upside down. But today I'm going to use the CTX, use the stock coil. I've been trying to for the last few years, but if you've watched my videos, you've seen me. I always end up going back to that small one. So there's so much iron and trash and nails and little 22 shells in here. It's just so hard to get through it all. Plus, then I don't have to dig a huge plug when I can't use pinpoint. But I'm going to try that with just the stock coin program with that check screen, you know, where it's just got like the L on it. Whatever. I, you guys know. But anyway, I'm going to see if I can dig something up. I'm hoping for at least my penny. Well, I'm glad I came out and I just ended up switching to the silver program. Just the stock silver program with, uh, yeah, with the auto sensitivity, not plus one or anything. And got a 142. And I don't know if you can see with this thing in there or not, but I see something sitting on its edge. And there it is. And that's going to be a silver. Looks like a 47 Rosie. That's silver 21. Awesome. Heck yeah, I got my silver for the day. I'm a happy camper. That's my first coin. I only dug three plugs, but this is my first coin. Awesome. I think I might have just got silver number two. I'm not sure. This was definitely penny numbers. But I don't know if you can see it right there. Definitely penny numbers. And it's another silver. Holy crap. That's silver number 22. Another rosy. Oh, come on. One of these days I'll get a bottle of water. I think it says 62. Yep, I think it says 62. But that's silver two for the day. And that's my only two coins so far. But yeah, this was definitely lower tone. And there might be a penny in there. <laughs> Keep digging and see. Not quite sure what this little cap thing looking thing hoochimagoo is, but it says Heather on the bottom of it. It looks like it pops open. I don't know. Weird. Sweet. Oh, wait. Only three coins today. Two silvers and one wheat out of here, but I'm hunting the same spot. But dang, I'm digging a lot more trash out. Getting a lot of six packs, 12 packs of nails. Good grief. And I'm not really getting much deeper with the stock coil right now. It's just because of all the iron and all the crap in here, so I'm trying to keep that bigger coil on. I think I might have just got a thimble. Let's see if I can see it in the screen here. Uh, there it is. Might be, or it might just be a piece of crap. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Nope, it's a thimble. Sweet, I love finding these things for some reason. Awesome. Not a bad day today. Looks like there's some writing on it too. So very cool. I'm gonna do the tailgate wrap up at the fairgrounds. There's the garbage for a couple hours this afternoon. And my fingers are froze. It's probably only 35, 34 degrees right now. And a little bit of clad, this little thing that says Heather on it. Shotgun shell, and then a couple silvers, few eats, and that thimble. So I'll get things cleaned up, let you know what they are. Here's a wrap up from the fairgrounds today. I ended up with a quarter, a nickel, a few pennies, four wheats. Oldest is 1914, then 1929, a 1938D, and a 1944D. And two more silvers, which puts me at 22 for the year. And 21 of those have come from the fairgrounds again. It's unreal what that place gives out, but just so hard to hunt. But I one's a 1947 and one's a 1962D. And then the old Winchester repeater, number 20 shotgun shell. It's 37 or after from what I can find. Then this thing says Heather on it and patent pending. There it is. No idea what it was used for. It doesn't have a year, so I can't really go by that when they tried to patent it. So any ideas? Thanks. I <laughs> appreciate it. And then the thimble, which is really cool. I love finding thimbles. This one still has a color on it, so I didn't clean it too much. But it's from Holland Furn er, Furnaces. Holland Furnaces make warmer friends. So it's an advertising symbol from Holland, Michigan. So sweet. That was kind of cool to find. But yeah, silver's 21 and 22. Any help ID in this little doohickey thing would be great. 
And an age on that would be nice. I tried finding something, but I couldn't find anything. But anyway, happy hunting, best wishes, and hoping spring gets here soon in Michigan.